Hello and welcome. This is week four or attempt four of Crash Landing. I'm our mystic, and as I just said, this is another week of Crash Landing. Now, this is the latest patch, uh, which is I don't remember what the patch is 1.1.2, .1 something like that. With the newest map that is um a bigger map so let's get right into it see crash landing 11 or 112b it's already been made this is already pr a pre-made map and so let's just get in and get going um i want to make these short videos so we'll just see so um to start your quest book use slash HQM base quest. Okay. Let's look around here for a second. See all the new stuff. Okay, we got controller of the cockpit and rooms. In case of emergency, break everything. Hmm. Okay. And we have some hills. There's some hills around. Okay. Let's just look around for a second and see what's going on. Okay. So, the map changed a little bit, but not too, too much. So, let's go ahead and get started. Um, let's get these things out that we will need. Bring the wrench off of here, and the crafting table can go there. So let's get started with quests. Okay, cool. That's cool. They added that. We don't need to look at that. We this is our fourth attempt, so we kind of know what's going on. But we need two fluid transposers, so let's get two fluid transposers and turn them in. We have the camel pack. Let's go ahead and fill it with water so we don't lose water. And next. Next we need dust and bone meal. So let's put one of those back. We're going to need that there. The other one we'll throw in the chest uh, along with all this water because we don't need it at the moment. And let's just grab some dust. Um, let's grab the dust by clearing out from around the ship to start, you know, making it to where mobs cannot spawn or cannot climb on top and then jump down from above except for spiders. Okay, so let's just do a little bit of maintenance here. That's glass. Okay. We also need to close the pyrothium off. So let's Oh, that's harder to close off. Whoa, that I could have died at the very start there. Um, how are we going to get... Okay, that should close that off. And let's just get rid of this here. Gotta be very careful. There's still more to get, but let's get some bone meal first and let's just get along with the get on with the quest. Okay. So let's just get some bone meal real quick here. There we go. Got some bone meal. So we need bone meal and we need a water bottle and then we can turn this in, manually submit, claim reward. Okay, next, uh, let's do the sapling thing. So we need a water bottle. Oh, we also need a power. Okay, let's put some power in there. Water bottle, turn that to zero. Okay, and let's 
do uh, select task, right click. Okay, remember, you have to select the task and right click. Okay, let's turn this one there and boom, we are done. Two more water bottles right off the bat. And we're next. Next we're to muddy water. So we just need an empty, well, we already have an empty bottle and dirt. So let's take the dirt, empty water, dirty water bottle, manually so, submit, and boom, there we go. Next is consume task rewards. Um, so let's manually submit. Okay, we got cold water and that's a new, we, we didn't have purified before. Uh, we can't do jerky yet, we finished that um, hard route or easy route. I want to do the easy route, honestly, just because it's easier. Okay, I want to use this, so let's attach that, and then... Oh, we need to turn this on. Is that on? No. Is that on? Yes, okay, so it's building us, so we have an extra life. That's, I figured, found out that's what this shell constructor is, is it basically makes an extra life for you. So it's building us. So we'll just let that go, and it'll build us. So when we die, we'll come back as a shell. Okay, so let's put this tree out. And the sapling. Now, let's go around and finish making the base impenetrable, except for spiders. And we need to build a little area around the front so we can do the trees at night. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, let's just make sure that this is all... Okay, this needs to be taken out. Okay, I think we're good there. Now we just need to build a little area. Um... Uh, We need some more dust. Now I'm trying to do everything as quick as possible for the simple reason of... Well, for several reasons. One, because the faster you do things, the faster you progress, which means the more likely you are to survive. Two, because it's a video, and so I want to get as much done in a video as possible for the highest amount of entertainment because doing things very slowly unless it's like a tutorial uh, isn't very interesting in my opinion so we're doing everything as fast as possible I'm talking about it as I'm doing it and I'm also trying to talk a little bit to you guys about other things but so far we need to finish doing this before we do that so that works. Uh, let's make a little stepping thing to we can get up on top. And let's get rid of some of this dust up here. Um, just because we can. We do need to start doing trees though. So let's actually start doing the tree stuff. And we'll put these to the side here. We need the bone meal. I said need the bone meal. Okay. So this goes over here. I'll put some more water bottles, and as well as this needle ammo goes in there as well. Uh, that can stack up there. Okay. So let's grow this tree. Okay, tree is grown. Let's get a log really quickly so we can make a crook. Because that's always the first thing you do in any type of map like this, where you're stranded, you always want to grow a tree and you build a crook. 
because crook, crooks give you more saplings. And that's what you want. You want saplings. Saplings are life. Shrek is not love. Shrek is not life. Saplings are life and love. Not big fan of saplings, honestly, but they get me from A to B, so to speak. Okay, so let's get this. Let's see if we can get one more tree uh, before nighttime rolls around. Okay, we also need to look at the quests to see what we need to do. Okay, there we go, nice. An apple, fantastic. Our water is good, our heat is good. Once it gets night time, I am going to take the camel pack off because the camel pack is used for two things. One, it's used to keep you hydrated, and two, it's used to help cool you off. So, it's nice to stay hydrated through the night, but you don't really need to um, unless it gets really low, or unless your water gets really low. So, I only like to use the camel pack, let's go ahead and take that off, when it's daytime, I'm making a barrel here by the way guys, if you don't didn't realize, um, let's put the barrel back here. Okay, that's almost done creating. There's a bunch of mobs out. Um, I don't think they can get to us. Hopefully not. We'll deal with them if they do. Let's get the... The gun and ammo just in case. Oh, that's not how you do it. You open it up by right-clicking and you put the ammo in. And then when you right click again is when you uh, use it. So we need to be careful of that. Oh, so let's have a, let's plant a sapling down just so we have one there. And we need to fill this barrel full. And while that's going, we will make another barrel. Because that's what we have the materials for is to make another barrel. Okay. And we have more wood going. Fantastic. So there's two blocks of of uh, dirt. Let's do some sifting here. Um, we don't have any more dust, so we can't sift anything else right now, which is unfortunate. Oh no, we do have dust. Okay. So let's just do some sifting um, while night happens. You can hear the mobs all around us. When it's daytime, we will run out and get some zombie flesh, because that's what we need for the next quest, or for one of the quests, is we need zombie flesh. We will also need bones. Um, which we will work on getting. Um, after I sift this dirt or this sand, I'm going to check on the dirt for one, and two, I'm going to start making some tinker's tools. So let's just finish sifting this dirt really quickly, and I will make the tinker's tools, or the tinker's tools the tables. Because we want to stay on top of things, we want to stay ahead, we want this to be high impact for crash landing because we have to get this done quickly. So whenever we have free time, whenever you, in crash landing, whenever you have free time, you want to sift, be sifting things or cutting down trees. Um, the reason I'm not still cutting down trees is two reasons. One, because I didn't fix the area to where skeletons can't shoot. So they can, there are spots where they can shoot me. And two, because um, let's use one of these, let's sift one of these dirt. And two, because saplings take more bone meal to grow at night. And so I don't want that to happen. So what do we need? What are we working on now? Questing. Okay, we can't do that until tomorrow. And this we need rotten flesh for. So really we're just kind of waiting. 
Oh, look, we're done. Okay. So uh, we have some power in there left. And we are done. Uh, there we are. I have my little skin. I need to change my skin, but I don't know what to change it to. There's zombies right there. And skeletons right there. I can make it like a mob farm if I take one of these, these glass out. Anyway. Um, let's make... Tinkers, that's what we're doing, Tinkers. So, let's get some, wait, sticks, right? Sticks is how you do that? Yeah. Okay, so let's get some sticks. We need three blank patterns to start with. Three blank patterns. We have our stencil table. We have our Pool station, and we have our part builder. Fantastic. Okay, so we have all three of these pieces here now. And what else can we do? We can do one pattern. We can do a one blank pattern. And I, we need to do the stencil table. I'm gonna go ahead and make the. It was it the crossbar? We'll go ahead and make the knife. The knife blade until we know what we need. So, knife blade will go in there for later. Actually, we can go ahead and make the knife. Nah, we'll wait. We will wait to make the knife blade until we have the quest for it. Now, let's go ahead and fill our water bottle. Or our camel pack, rather. Just so we have it all nice and ready when it's time to put it on. We are at 77 water and that's not necessarily good but it's still nighttime. See there's zombies. It's still nighttime for a little while. Um, let's go, let's use the crescent hammer for right now to kill the spider. Come on. No. Do not go back up there. Okay, there's zombies right there. There's skeletons right there that can shoot us. Get back in. Okay, it's almost... It's getting daytime. But it's not quite daytime. So let's eat this jerky that we have to fill up. And we just kind of have to wait for the moment. I don't like waiting, but there's nothing we can really do quite yet. Um, we can put some of this stuff away. Um, we need to... We don't have any more wood, so we can't make any more crooks quite yet. We have some fish that we can eat if we need to. Water bottles don't go in here. Water bottles go in there. Blaze powder also goes over here and salt as well. I want to try to stay organized so I know where everything is. Um, let's put this stuff in there for right now. Okay, so we took the easy route, which means we got all this stuff. Um, we need tools of the trade, which is a stone hammer and a bone crook. Once we get the bone crook, we can get this done here because um, we have enough stone for a hammer. Okay, it's getting daytime. Just a few more minutes. Hello. What? Was that a fire creeper? There's a fire creeper, plague zombie. Fire creeper, plague zombie. I thought th thought I saw a, a thief skeleton. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. They've changed this since last time we played. Not just the map, but the mobs too. Can we have another dirt? I think we're gonna plant a second tree right over there once it becomes more daytime. Nope, you're not gonna shoot me. Okay. So guys, I'm going to end this episode here, and then we will start up immediately for next episode.
I haven't decided if I'm going to just put the episodes up the same day or just consecutively one after another for this, until I die. I don't know. But guys, I will see you next time. And peace out.